do we improve our democracy? Is by changing the constitution. We need to look at the constitution. We need to look at the constitution. And the only person who cannot be intimidated to look at the constitution, it's Edgar Lungu. Because Edgar Lungu, he has actually that history. When Ivasata started the, uh, that constitutional, uh, the technical committee of his, they had a draft which went to Kuliwa Winter. By that time, Winter was a justice minister, and they held, on, they, they held it. Until Edgar Lungu came in. When Edgar Lungu came in, he released that constitution. Without even fearing some of the things that were going to work against him. But he released it. So he has shown that desire, that will to change the constitution. Even when he was president, he brought in Bill 10. Bill 10, you people that criticize Bill 10, you just didn't understand Bill 10. Today, what do you have? Do you think Haka Inde Ichilema, who shot down Bill 10, do you think he had the best interest for the country? He didn't. He didn't. But Bill 10 had a number of progressive clauses. So, my point is that Edgar Lungu has already shown goodwill in trying to improve the constitution. So, is the best person for us to sit around and make sure that we change the constitution, we strengthen our constitution. Most of these problems that we are facing are as a result of the bad constitution that we have. Some of us, we are here in exile because of the bad constitution that we, we, we have, where the president has got so much powers, such that he, Haka Inde Ichilema, he's prosecuting people, he investigates, he, he arrests, he prosecutes, he sentences Haka Inde Ichilema because of too much powers. The institutions of government, the different institutions of government, they are useless. They are useless. It is what Haka Inde Ichilema wants. That is what will go. So we need, we need a good constitution that will give some autonomy and some autonomy, some independence and some security of tenure to some of these institutions such that people will not be scared of the president. People will not be scared of cadres. Uh, so we need that in our constitution. Only the constitution can sort out that. So Edgar Lungu at least has shown that goodwill already, and at least he's only going to be there for five years. So for sure he can be able to help us so resolve the issue of the constitution. So, and uh, apart from that, to run a campaign, it is not easy. To run a campaign is not easy. To run a campaign, it's not easy. You need resources. The only person that can be able to galvanize or mobilize resources is Ed Galungu because he's a former president. It is easier for Ed Galungu to mobilize resources. Our one server, they cannot mobilize resources. Now, this argument of saying, no, let's see Ed Galungu appoint somebody. Let's just be real. Let's just be real. We have seen what had happened in the past. Uh, FTJ went and woke up Mwanawasa to make him president. Eh? Went and woke up Mwanawasa to make him president. What happened? Mwanawasa came and pe persecuted Chiruba like no money's business. Today we don't have a legacy of Chiruba because of the way Mwanawasa, you know, just messed, messed, him, messed the man up. Today we have our Nawakwa Chiruba going to, uh, to steal Ushiku. Going to steal Ushiku because of the way Mwanawasa treated, treated the uh, uh, FTJ. Eh? But Maewa Vera, I mean, I don't even know how she's living. Because of Mwanawasa, the way Mwanawasa handled FTJ. Mwanawasa didn't handle FTJ well. And yet, he's the man that brought him. So, he is the man that, you know, Aka Saloyu, Aka Saloyu, Aka Saloyu. Mule tontonganyo kwa ti mshe Ed Galungu. Enatakwe tomwe nso. Kwa kwa ti mshenga na Musaloyi. 
Takesen Chinsha Manu, what guarantee can you can you can you bet on on any of these people or any of us? What guarantee can you give to say Uyunga Musara Edgarungu, Takesem Chinshama? Epa you wafia pa. Because mwa wat mwa mu mulef mwana kwa tichivili easy kwa no edigalungu akasale fio you akasale fio I'm giving you where we are coming from. I'm giving you where we are coming from. There was another another incident. Ba ba mwana wasa we ba mwana wasa ilio ba ba winina my elections ba ilesa ba ilesa la ba ba ntuanita ba never swim eh. Vice Salava never smumbo babika ba vice president what happened what happened mwe ba kali mwalishwa katwishi vefiba if if umuntu ngakwata power katwishi vefisa mo ba never smumbo ba ishine tambo kwa kwache ba president bambo ku imono ku change ku chira mwana wasa bambo ku mwana mwana wasa ati a mwana wasa mulwele eh ine nyine na alinga you can imagine you can move away go to Eh, go to eh, to to eh, I, I usually avoid talking about other countries but <laughs> I, I usually avoid talking going to another country but anyway if i can just go pazi bana ntani pabos wana pabos wana just pabos wana ilio ian kama alif map he he put masisi there today ian kama is in exile in South Africa that's where he is he's in exile in South Africa they have differed big time yeah what what see you know i'll pick it is these are important hello enquire eh but uh, you know ngana mona ka namba kenu eh uh, kwi kwi ni You know, there are some reliable people ebo nga nga watu manishwa shivati kuri something kuri tikuti kuti ule landa landa kanshi pali abantu panse so that's why na sukira eh evanje vakwati oh ndef chitef 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 so i had to answer that one eh because kuti ule savaira savaira kanshi na vaku bombinga vali panse apa anyway so I was I was talking about uh, uh, you know the the trust it's very difficult to trust umuntu chali shu pafie eh tu ifyangu sha kufuna kati no pantu ni edga lungu ena edga lungu kuti asonta kati yo kala vai minina yo mundu vira minina yo tayari minina panda ine kuti anza kuti kuti naine wine ndevu fwa vukateka naine wine ndevu fwa eh 